Yo, what's up guys? It's NLW Figs here with my room tour. Yes, yesterday I showed you guys a little bit of a preview of my room uh, and I've just been tweaking some stuff since then. Uh, this video is also going to be filmed on my phone, so um, it's going to be a little bit different to the normal format of video, so the quality might not be as good, but I didn't want to break the Christmas streak that I've been on where I've been uploading a video every day. So expect the videos to be uh, more in the standard format starting from tomorrow leading up to next Saturday, Christmas Day. Uh, but yeah, I just wanted to get this one out here and show you my room. But without further ado, I'll stop rambling and I'll just show you how I've got things set up in my kind of workspace. So we'll start off with the arena and we've got the ring here with uh, the ring printouts that I've made and this custom like AEW WWE hybrid ring that I've made here. And then we've also got the stage over here. So this just big um, TV screen uh, with the staging area there. And that's where I can kind of put on uh, whatever stage is necessary for um, the different events. And I'm looking forward to making the metal stage actually uh, very soon, as soon as my hard drive's fixed. And up here, we've got the um, the crowd printout from Rasalistic. This is falling over. I'm going to have to stop this from uh, falling any more. Uh, but we've also got like this great printout from him. And this uh, is the old Extreme Sets printout and it just kind of curves along. And you can see here, this is just a couple of stuff that I'm still looking for places for. So yeah, you've mostly seen the ring area and stuff like that, but you might not have seen like behind the scenes. So we've got these two photography lamps here and here, and these kind of beam the light so there's no shadows. And I've also got this light uh, above here, which kind of gives the um, a yellow tint to it, but I kind of edit that in post. And this is the tripod that I use and I put my um, my camera on. I don't know what the kind of make is, but I think it's just an Amazon basic tripod. And this is actually on, so this whole thing here is on a table. So when we go underneath the table, uh, we can see a little bit more of what I've got hidden back here. So over here, we've got a couple of cage pieces as well as, you know, a couple of trucks and stuff. And here's where the TV is kind of plugged into. And these are like a lot of extreme sets pop-ups and stuff like that. So you've got like the locker room, the backstage area, the hallway, bar, whatever you have. Uh, back here, more Hell in the Cell cage pieces. And this is my Raw is War big Titantron set. And down here as well, we've got a couple of New Japan figures, which I'm trying to find places for. I might need to put a shelf up, actually, maybe above the ring area. But we'll see kind of what happens with that. Also got this ECW Championship belt. And over here, just more of the same, really. Like, we've got a couple of crowd printouts, this six-sided ring. We've also got this uh, box full of kind of stage pieces, green screens, what have you, and then more crowd backgrounds just behind there and down here. Just more stuff that I need to sort through. This is the stuff for the Raw Arena and the SmackDown Rebook stuff. So, And again, a couple of cardboard boxes. And I've got a couple more like hidden behind there, uh, behind the curtain. But that's kind of a mess at the moment. I don't really want to show that. Uh, but we'll move on to... This bit here so moving up this is uh, the custom shelf that you kind of saw in my last video so at the top we've got a couple of hard drives um, we've also got uh, a bit of reorganizing so I've kind of tried to reorganize some of these guys so I've got like the rocks here and then a couple of figures behind here which you might have seen in my custom figure collection so some of these were made by 14 fig uh, figs 31 TSM uh, a couple of people uh, but yeah this is just so that they're not crushed in with the other figures here just so that I can have them on their own separate display. And as you move down, we've also got the um, the Hulk Hogan's and like the Storm Collectible stuff going on there. Moving on here, we've also got uh, these boxes full of wrestling figures. So, and then we've got like the AEW um, Titan Tron made by a uh, wrestler So we've got the figures, as I said yesterday, organized in um, alphabetical order. So the taller ones are at the top because it's uh, you know quite a short thing. And then the, the ones that can actually fit in here, I've just kind of slotted in like that. And I'm gonna try and add two more to this just so I've got more space to work with, but I'm trying to utilize more vertical space. So as you can see down here, it goes to like A, B, C, D, and then all the way down to like X and S and all that sort of stuff. And then we've got some AEW figures and a couple of basics uh, lodged in there as well, just for the time being. And then like my women's collection, as well as a couple more basics down there, like Jack's coming in here. And then also like just crowd bits and pieces and just more organizational stuff. And I've actually moved the hands out of the um, out of this bit and into another bit, which I'll show in a minute. But this is kind of how I've organized stuff at the moment. So you've got 
your chairs together, tables, uh, kendo sticks, you name it, all kind of organized in there. And that's just an empty drawer at the moment as well. And we got like ropes and stage pieces and then like, you know, your, your stretchers, your wheelchairs, what have you. And I actually quite like this AEW basic ring because I'm going to put this on top of here, perhaps, and just have something else like kind of displayed on it. But we'll move on. And then we've got a shelf here as well. So you can kind of see what's going on there. I want to take a screenshot of this. This is a, this is a decent thumbnail right here. <laughs> Boop. There we go. So, yeah, we've got another kind of collection. And I thought, uh, I've got a fair few uh, Triple H and Undertaker figures. So I thought it would be cool to kind of have it above my PC, just above here. So you can start with your Randy Orton's and your Triple H's. And then you move down to your Undertaker's and your Kane's. Just there. Um, again, these are quite, these are too tall. So... They don't fit in here, so I thought it would be cool to just kind of have them on display here. And just down here as well, we've got a couple more figs. So um, apologies for the exposure there, but you can see um, Roman Reigns, Vader, and the like. And we'll move on up here as well. My new um, my new custom, well, not custom, but a jewellery box from my missus. So we've got uh, a couple of little drawers and pieces that you can use for jewellery. Um, and I found it really useful thus far. So up here we've got the Cody um, LGN, which I've kind of displayed up there, as well as a couple of posters. That's the uh, event I went to back in 2019, uh, where Pack faced Osprey, and then a couple of you know posters for the uh, WWE figures. So yeah, up here we've got like all sorts of um, stuff organised into little compartments. So we've got like modern championships, classic championships, Attitude Era, ECW, that kind of thing, and then the hands are sort of organised into different bits. So you've got like AEW hands, two sweet hands, stuff like that, gloves. Um, and sort of, yeah, just more organised so that the nays, you've got Jeff Hardy and AJ Styles hands, just so it's easier to get to. And then you've got stuff like this where you've got like briefcases, drinks, um, and then also like stuff like this where you've got microphones and then down here. Just a couple of heads and like custom fodder really to, um, to kind of organise it in a better way. And I've also got my camera down here so I can kind of slot that in and then just my, um, you know, bits and pieces of um, kind of uh, like paints stuff like that down here and I've got my work top here with my PC and then back here as well I've actually got this cool little um uh what what would you call it whiteboard that's it sorry <laughs> um a little whiteboard where I've got uh, a list of uh, stuff I want to do obviously this is out of date now because my hard drive's broken but this is what I was planning on doing um beforehand if you can kind of have a look at that that's what I was planning on doing um, before my hard drive busted and um, I had to kind of reschedule but it's cool because I can kind of write out my schedule on here and have like a visual representation of it and then we've just got my little microphone here and if we move down here as well I've got a couple of stuff uh, like printouts, uh, paints and more kind of uh, printouts and uh, stuff like that so you've got like the Wrestlemania 12 um, and like the Firefly Funhouse stuff like that and then we've got like uh, you know just a couple of more uh, bits and pieces of barricade and things of that nature but that's pretty much it really like it's not a complex room tour at all like I want to do like a more in-depth one uh, in future just when uh, I've kind of settled in a little bit more and I know kind of what space I'm working with and I've kind of um, figured stuff out I have got a couple of plans to make some uh, dioramas as well so lord knows where they're going to be stored but yeah apologies for the kind of low quality video today I did want to do a room tour but you know, I don't have the time to fully edit uh, like a proper video, really. Uh, so that's why you're getting it on the uh, on the old phone. But tomorrow uh, uploads will be um, in the normal format where um, I think I'm going to do tomorrow uh, my top 10 favorite matches of the year and then maybe top 10 figs of the year the day after. So, uh, yeah, look out for those. Um, but yeah, like, again, I'm kind of ad libbing here. But thank you so much for uh, sticking with me. And it's been tough to do daily videos this month but um i needed to do something and keep my mind occupied whilst my hard drive was getting fixed still no update on that i'll try and get one for you um in the week i'll try and message the guy on monday and see um, what's going on with that and when nlw can potentially come back but i'm really eager to start animating again and i'm looking forward to showing you guys what i've got in store but as for this room tour that's it from me make sure you like the video if you enjoyed and subscribe to nlw figs for more wrestling figure content and comment down below what you think of the room tour and if you've got any ideas or suggestions really as to how I can kind of improve things. So there you go. That's it from me. Thank you all for watching. I'll catch you guys later.